kids, April 4th, Red Robe Astrology. Well, the full moon is a brewing. It hits tomorrow. The moon's in Virgo right now, moving into Libra today. That officially starts up the full moon. Today we'll have an amplified full moonish kind of energy just from the fact that the full moon's a brewing. We also have a very long void moon today, nine hour void moon. Now, voids are not bad. They just prefer a kind of inner stillness. And on a day when we might have things to do, um, just know that a long void means you're going to have comfort with behind the scenes, making lists, planning, chores, resting, um, and that you might feel a little squirrely if you're trying to push out, make contact, and get things accomplished. Subtle energy, but just understand we've got a void from 6.49 a.m. Pacific time to 2.50 p.m. Pacific time, uh, after which the moon moves into Libra, lighting up the full moon, um, and a very different sensation in the days, kind of a two act day with the void Virgo moon in the first part and then once the moon moves into Libra she trines Pluto creating a kind of pleasant depth of feeling and the latter part of this day and the evening hours of uh, Pacific time Agitation to Uranus might mean sudden changes in plans, some inconjuncts, the great eliminator angle from the moon to Mercury, Saturn, and the North Node sort of d demands that there'll be some pivots or shifts in plans in the latter part of this day. From an archetypal perspective, we are in the release process uh, of this relationship-oriented full moon in Libra that hits tomorrow. We are letting some shit go so that we can have better interactions and relationships uh, with all of our loved ones in our lives. Have at this day. Get ready for a big full moon.